What's up you guys? Welcome back to the not so daily vlog. Uh, today is the first day of me trying out this Monday, Wednesday, Friday daily vlog sort of upload schedule. Um, so we'll see how it is. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of this. Um, without further ado, let's go ahead and get to my day. Hi baby. Guys, it's raining outside. I really do like rain, but it feels like it feels like natural for it to be raining during like the shutdown too because it's like it makes sense because you can't go outside and so it's like oh yeah you, you places are closed you can't go outside it's raining you know i don't know it when it's like a rainy day you're expected to stay indoors and like stay in bed and things like that i think eli's tired of me being home she wants me to leave all right guys i am about to head out so let's go and start my day about to head into work um get the day rolling guys look at how beautiful it is it's a beautiful rainy day out here in southern california So in last week's daily vlog, I had gone through all of the journals that I have when I talked about the importance of journaling. And one of those journals that I had was a journal where I kept track of all of my life coaching information. Now I'm not a certified life coach, but I do have like this passion for inspiring and motivating people. And I thought that the best way for me to do that was through starting a life coaching business. The idea had originally come up when I was talking to my friend Ty back in September of 2018. So I've now been Ty's life coach for about a year and a half. So I know I had said that it was like a life coach business that I started, but it's really not a business for me. It's more of just like a hobby. Uh, it's just something that I'm really passionate about doing. Uh, for those of y'all who don't really know what a life coach is, it's basically like this uh, this person who kind of helps you um, work towards your goals and aspirations. They kind of help map out your life and try to move you forward towards proceeding in different goals. Um, it's, it's kind of just someone who holds you accountable for things. I've personally had a really great time helping people progress towards their goals. I think it's such a gratifying feeling to be able to see somebody that you've helped motivate and help like progress in life get to those goals and, and just conquer them. So the way that I do it is that like about once a month I'll meet up with a person that I'm a life coach to, whether it be like in person or over FaceTime or whatever, and I will like talk to them about their old goals, I'll see how they've progressed and stuff, we'll reestablish new goals and talk about like where to move forward from there. And then the goals that I always have them establish is um monthly goals, weekly goals, and daily goals that they're going to accomplish within that month so that we have something to talk about the next time we meet up. Eli's like right next to me because I'm eating food and she keeps trying to like get into it but look at see she was right under the camera and I was just like hoping she didn't pop up. She can't have my spinach but it's mine. All right y'all we just wrapped up a, uh, a life coach meeting coronavirus edition shutdown edition um, and that, that's about it I'll see you next month Nikki. <laughs> I'll see you then. Hopefully I'm doing a lot more than uh, I'm doing now. Hopefully things are open. <laughs> All right, Joe, we just finished our life coach session. Um, this is this is Ness. She's one of my, my coaches. I don't know what to call you. My students. I know. That's what I was trying to think of a word when you said it. Yeah, I, was... I, I don't want to call you my client because that's not like what this is, but like. She's my therapy coach. I'm, I'm <laughs> alive right now. <laughs> yeah, that, that's where we're at with this whole COVID thing. Um, but yeah, then we've wrapped up our session for this month. It's it's been a little bit weird with all this uh, shutdown thing, but we're making do. As we can. Yeah. All right, y'all. So I got some life coach meetings done today. That was pretty fun. I always enjoy doing those. Like I said, like this is just a really big passion of mine. I like just helping inspire people and like get them on tracks. I don't know. It, it's just a thing that I love doing. I always like watching like um, like self help videos and stuff too and reading self-help books. I think that's super interesting. But I just kind of want to plug this here. If you guys are ever, ever interested in maybe trying out a life coach of your own, uh, go ahead and hit me up. Uh, just, just send me an email. My email is thenatashajen at gmail.com. It'll be in the description and it's all over my YouTube page as well for my, my uh, business email. Um, and I'll give you guys more information about it because I think it is just like a really beneficial thing for, for everyone to have or to try out once. All right, guys, so that's going to be it for today's not-so-daily daily vlog. I couldn't really do much today because of the fact that it was raining, um, but good news is I got a lot of stuff done for, like, actual, like, work. Uh, so I got a lot of things done for my, my channel and for my life coaching things and my journaling, so that was good. I, I felt pretty productive along those lines. I did some skills some Skillshare classes, and I did some Duolingo, so that was really cool. Um, but... 
yeah, sorry if today wasn't as active as the daily vlog usually is, but I appreciate you guys so much for watching this video. Like the video down below if you enjoyed. Um, it really helps me out, y'all. Go and subscribe to my channel to see more content like this, and I will see you on Wednesday with another Not So Daily daily vlog. Peace out, guys. Bye.